Who is this? Dr. McNiter, this is Beth. Beth Chapel. We spoke before, remember? You warned me about Eclipso. Hello? What are you doing with my goggles? I found them. Welcome everyone to another video today. My name is Nicholas or Nick Greer. It doesn't matter to me, so let's get into it. And today I will be talking about the DC Comics character, Dr. Midnight, Beth Chapel. She made her first appearance in Infinity Inc. Issue 19 in October of 1985. She will appear again as Dr. Midnight in issue 21 of the same series in the same year in December of 1985. She was created by Roy Thomas and Todd McFarlane, the creator of Spawn. Beth Chapel was born in Orangeburg, South Carolina, with her father working as a pastor and her mother singing in the choir. Beth also has four brothers. When Beth encounters Mr. Bones, she was rushed to the hospital as she was infected by his cyanide touch. During the beginning of Crisis on Infinite Earths, Beth was blinded by an oxygen explosion. Luckily, she was rescued by Rick Tyler, aka the next Hour Man. As Dr. McNiter, the original Dr. Midnight, performed surgery on Beth, he enhanced her ability to see in the dark since he can't restore her blindness. Beth and Rick took the mantle of Dr. Midnight and Hour Man. Teaming up with the new Wildcat, Yolanda Montez, who I made a video on, they applied for membership to the Infinity Inc. Unfortunately, this, this was short-lived as Infinity Inc. was disbanded. Beth and Rick would have a romantic relationship afterwards. Moving on, the new Dr. Midnight and Wildcat were recruited by the government to take down Eclipso, a magical supervillain. Like other superheroes, Beth was one of the few heroes to lose their life to Eclipso. In the Doomsday Clock event, Beth Chapel returns to life alongside other Justice Society of America members, including the Legion of Superheroes. This was thanks to the super duper powerful cosmic being, Dr. Manhattan. It stated that Beth opened up a medical metahuman clinic. Now let's move on to her powers and abilities. She has no superhuman abilities, but she does have night vision where she could see in the dark with her special goggles.